Yeah, it was there. The effort to get that ball back, the extra pass, the attack to the rim, and the drop off, resulting to two points for Ken Tuffin. Welcome to the second half. This is UAP Wednesday live on SNA. Ayun yung pressure na sinasabi ni Coach Olsen. I need you to pressure the basketball a little bit more. Well, they pressured the ball a lot in the first half and uh, Coach Olsen really raising the standards for defense here in the uh, third period. That's a traveling violation against uh, LJ Gonzalez. The other, the other team. Estimosa will start the play. Falcon still down by 12. Last team also knocks down the three. And showing us the stroke. Malayo na ako pero hinapul pa doon Cyrus Torres. So great effort by Torres. Here's Tuffin. Okay, Tuffin to Chuente. Back to Tuffin. Tuffin goes right and uh, Simon Camacho commits a foul. The team foul against the Falcons. Stockton, Gonzalez. Oh, that was blocked by Malapas. The athleticism of Malapas. And the athleticism of Lastimosa. A great defensive stand there Shot by the soaring Comboy on the left side. Shot clock reads eight. When the Lino Comboy gets away, and a putback is good for Pancho Wente. Again, that's uh, aggressiveness coming from the guards of FEU. When the Comboy, even though he missed, he, get, he did get the attention of Lenda Duanga leaving Pachuente wide open for the stick back. First field goal for FEU in the third quarter. We're nearing the halfway mark of the third period. Ahan Misi to Mojica. Mojica fires as we hit our Gatorade hydration checkpoint. Again, great defense for FEU though, but they can, can they convert? And that will be a foul against Simon Camacho. That will be his third. Sharing all of that knowledge to all the FEU players as Comboy knocks down the three. Domino's Pizza, what a delivery play. That's a big three off of the timeout for FEU. Wendell Comboy, only the second field goal for FEU in this game. Adamson. Well, FEU has been scoring, but they've also clamped down on the Adamson scoring Falcons. Scoreless in the last... Five minutes and change for the Falcons. Alforque fires a three. Another re uh, rebound for Duanga and he was fouled. But you see the effort there for Ken Tuffin. Foul on right number now, Duanga and Bola still trying to That's get that ball back. As we look at this, Royce Alforque, the patience to look at Pachuente, getting the attention was bad and leaving Wendell Comboy wide open. From the left wing and Sydney Crespo, I'm sure missing his uh, <laughs> former boys. Is there like an FU uh, <laughs> reunion? Why is everybody here? <laughs> Meantime, Lastimosa trying to lob that pass to Duanga, and that's a turnover. Again, great defense. <laughs> Lastimosa, Duanga. <laughs> <laughs> to catch not, that pass. Not only telling him, <laughs> 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 Meantime, here's Alforque. Under four minutes remaining here in the third quarter. And Alforque will go to work against Bernardo. Dribbling violation. A little too much sauce on that hesitation move was Royce Alforque. He really got excited because he was really big. You know, when you're a big fan, you're a big fan. Tapos nag-switch sa pick and roll. Okay, akin na to. A little too much sauce there for Royce Alforque. Ball will go back to Adamson. And Alforque now harassing uh, Valchauka. Three and a half to go in the third quarter. FU still ahead. 48-34. Moika. Handoff. Lastimosa. Lastimosa drops. Comboy. But Comboy gets the rebound off the miss. Comboy is on the move. Trying to go for a bounce pass to Tuffin. Lastimosa to Mojica. And Mojica is fouled. Is and the basket Mojica. is good. Stopped Valchauk and the rest of the Falcons. But stopping is an understatement. Valchauk has zero points here today. Lenda Duanga. And Lenda Duanga making up for it with rebounds and putbacks. And a Yamaha number, four, number one University. move. The Falcons still working to get back in this game. We'll be back after this timeout. The Philippines placed host to the 2019 SEA Games with the theme we win as one, the opening ceremony. 
is on November 30. That's a Saturday, and you can uh, catch SEA Games action right here on SNA, Liga, uh, the ABS CBIP Sports website, and I want. So glad you could join us on this uh, pleasant Wednesday afternoon. Uh, we're coming to you from the Big Dome. Nico Alili with uh, Mikey Reyes, uh, Rain Matienzo, and Maurice Domingo. Your broadcast quartet for this afternoon. And right now, FU still ahead, 48-39. Usually getting good possessions off of timeouts is FU, but in that, at that time, throwing the ball away was Alex Stockton. Ball will go back to Adamson and the momentum. Mojica of the glass. Battle, furious battle for the basketball. Basta may battle, nandun si Alex Tacto. <laughs> si Black Panther, basta may battle. Eh. <laughs> and here we're talking about Val Chama, 19 points in their last game against UP, 17 in the first half. But here today, just not finding the mark at all. 0 of 6 from the field. That's a, that's a foul on Stockton. And, you know, Valchauk did not appreciate because he was in Stockton's neck. He was in Stockton's neck. He was in Stockton's neck. And Chauk did not like it. Made uh, Stockton known. Uh, and he was in the back of Chauk. That's why he was in the back of Chauk. And uh, Chauk and Stockton needs to be, they need to be separated here. But I believe this is what Val Chauka needs also. Two free throws for him. Two open shots at the rim. And again, if you're the scorer, you'd want to see the ball go through the hoop. And for Val Chauka, at least here for today, a chance for him to see that for the first time. You know, I, uh, I had the privilege to interview uh, UAP legends uh, Carl Brian Cruz. Rich, uh, Rich Escoto, uh, 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 Jasper Parker, and Rema Rose. And I asked, sino ba yung pinakaayaw nyo na player? Ang sabi ni Carl Brian Cruz, ah, wala eh. Kasi nasa amin yun, yung pinakaayaw na lahat, <laughs> si Ron Denison na. That's what, that's what Carl Brian Cruz said. He's, of course, he can say that. Dahil syempre, taga-LPU siya eh. But, <laughs> Na-practice nila na experience oh. si Ron Denison. <laughs> And, uh, you know, it's not FEU unless you have one pesky guy. Oh, yeah. And you love to have that guy on your team. And you hate him to be on the other you team. You hate, you hate <laughs> him as an opponent, but you love to have him on your team because that guy, like Stockton, will do everything in their power to help your team win. Here's Stockton on the left side. On the, approaching the last two minutes of the third quarter, Alex Stockton finds Barkley Ebonia who overshoots. Jerome Lastimosa gets the rebound. Lastimosa to Chauka. Chauka zigzagging and then sends it back to Lastimosa. Lastimosa inside. Lastimosa with a miss. And the ball will go out in favor of FEU. Lastimosa has had, has had opportunities at the rim after a great move to beat his defender and coach Alden Ayo. Getting ready for his matchup yep. later on. Assistant coach Bakjur Luib. Sure. The rest of the USD Growling Tigers getting ready for their 4 p.m. showdown with the De La Salle Green Archers as Ebonia misses the runner. And there's a loose ball foul after that miss. How I miss watching Coach McJur play. <laughs> and, uh, Holding foul on assisting number eight, Coach Alvin Ayo. And these are the two teams also that Coach so Alvin Ayo has, four, has just, to keep an eye on. Because again, si Lake Magkakalaban for a final four spot. I, I bet you still remember that uh, brilliant, brilliant play by Bakjur Luib <laughs> in the finals <laughs> of, of a free throw. That move should be in the Basketball <laughs> Hall of Fame. Yun yung sinabi ni Coach Aldin. Mag-assist mag 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 coach to <laughs> si Bakjur. <laughs> That's uh, that's quite a partnership, by the way. Aldinayo and uh, Magjur Luib, and uh, wow, boy, they're hoping to lead UST to win number eight uh, later today. Meantime, all eyes are on Lenda Duwanga working hard on, off the boards. Uh, Duwanga with 10 rebounds or 15, 15 rebounds so far in this game. It's been a rebound battle between Duwanga and Pat Chuente. 16 rebounds for Chuente, 15 for Duwanga. And here in the third quarter, ice cold as FEU compared to their first half. 14% from the field for the Tamarao is not the kind of offense you want to see. 
And LJ Gonzalez could not complete the move. Under two minutes remaining here in the third. Falcons down by seven. Chauka fires a three. At 17 rebounds for Chuente. Torres, he's open. But says, you know what? I'll just give it to Comboy first. We're not in a rush. Comboy. He fires a three. Too strong. And that's two misses. So the last two possessions for FBU. And Val Chauka still continuing to try to score. Zero, still zero points here so far with one minute and 20 left in the third quarter as coach. Olsen Rasella putting in or taking out Pat Chuente. Binigyan muna ng pahinga. Well deserved. Oh, 16 rebounds, 17 well, rebounds. Well deserved breather with just a minute and 19 remaining in the third. Four steals for Adamson here in the third quarter. Anisi. Bermin back to Anisi. 10 to shoot. Anisi for three. And these are just tough shots from Anisi and Valchalka. But these are shots that they can make. So, hindi lang talaga nila mabutas pa. Here's Gonzalez for two. Gonzalez. And the speed of LJ Gonzalez. Jollibee 100% amazing move for uh, LJ Gonzalez. We were talking about in the first half how he can go from 100 to 0, but you can't forget how he can go from 0 to 100. And that's a bucket there for LJ Gonzalez. Meantime, Chauka needs help. Shot clock down to 8. Shot clock down to 5. Chauka for 3. 0 of 8. So far for ja Fal Chao, a great defense again for LJ Gonzalez. And still a nine-point lead for FEU with 17 seconds remaining here in the third quarter. Gonzalez drives. That was intended for Ebonia. That's another Ball, drive there for LJ Gonzalez. So he could have off. taken the shot, but look at this. Going left, going all the way to the rim, finishing with his right. LJ Gonzalez again, showing us the quickness and the speed to get to the rim. Five to shoot for FEU. Ebonia to Brent Rebien as he can hit the three. He fires the three. And the shot clock expires. Well, action will continue here. One second to go, and uh, Anisi almost, uh, almost beating the buzzer At the end of the to third end the third quarter. quarter. FU still the in control. The They're on top 50-41 at the end of the third quarter. We'll be back with the payoff period after these. 